What's going on guys, Sessing here, welcome to Bootham. If you don't know what this game is, well, neither do I, so let's find out together. I mean, it's pretty obvious from the picture of the background. It is a horror game, but I'm not exactly sure what the horror game is going to be about. I mean, this this looks like some sort of a freaking, uh, I don't know, a hospital or something? A room in a hospital, something like that? I'm not exactly sure, maybe it's a crazy hospital or whatever it is called. So, uh, yeah, let's just get right to it. Let's get right to the game. Before I get started, let me just say a huge announcement. For every single person that's gonna like this video, he will have a probability to live another year in this world. So uh, yeah, let's get right to it. New game. Escape Bootham. Alright, so I'm I'm supposed to escape this place. Okay, let's let's freaking do hello. How's it going? Okay, so uh, I alright, so I'm inside a hospital called Bootham. That's the thing I have figured out till now. Okay, I can't see anything. Okay, what do we have here? We have, uh, hold on a second, we have something, okay, can I click on these numbers or is there a point? Okay, you have 873 seconds to escape blue, blue thumb or what? What's gonna happen if I do not escape in this 850 seconds? Okay, we have here a bunch of uh, useless stuff. I don't, I don't know what to do here. All right, let's, uh, let's. Uh, how do I click this? How do I click on this thing? How, how do I? Ho hold on a second. I don't even know. Holy shit! The game starts, and I don't even know how to leave the fucking room. I don't even know how to leave the beginning room. What the hell? How, how? What am I supposed to do? Can I just open this door? Can I just open this door? Is this a possibility? No, it's not. It's not. I'm clicking everything in existence. It's not. Alright, let me just take a look at the controls. There is no options at all. Okay, fantastic. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Okay, I have an inventory, so apparently I'm gonna have to pick up some stuff so that I would put it in this inventory, obviously. Uh, right, what do we have to pick up right here? And what the hell just happened? Where the hell did the light go? Oh yeah, okay, I, I turned it off and on by pressing F button. Okay, that was, that was kind of random. Alright, I clicked on every fucking button in the keyboard until I finally got to be able to use this fucking pink code thing. So, uh, yeah, apparently the, the game doesn't tell you any controls or anything. You just have to figure it out by yourself. But, uh, yeah, I, you just have to click all the buttons until you know which one is which. So, let's enter the code, which I have no idea what it is. Absolutely no, no freaking clue. Okay, one, two, three, four. How am I supposed to know the code? How am I supposed to know the code? Alright, I'll just keep looking around the freaking room and maybe I will be able to find out something and how to know the fucking code. I have no idea how am I supposed to know the fucking code, but uh, let's just keep looking around the room for some reason. Alright, how about I try to open the door immediately? Is that... Okay, the door is locked and uh, you have to try and find the code. What code? How am I supposed to find the code? How do I crouch? How do I crouch? I mean, I'm pretty sure if I'm able to crouch, I'll actually be able to find the code immediately. So how do I freaking crouch right now? Alright, let's type a random number. Maybe I'm the luckiest person in the history of existence and it's gonna come right. Of course not. Of course not. That, 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 it, that will never work in not, in not a million years. Alright, there is something here. So let me just see. Yesterday there was a breakout and all I like about it is change the code for my rooms. Changed into... Alright, 3657. That was it. Seriously, that was fucking it. A uh, random paper in the floor telling me what the code of the fucking page is. Okay, uh, like seriously, that's how it works. Okay, I forgot the code. I forgot the code. What was it again? 3657. 3657. 3657. 3657. 3657. Oh, there we go. I remember it now. I remembered it. And there we go. That door is fucking opened. Now open up. Um, oh, oh, Open the fuck up. There we go, exactly what I, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Alright, I know that you guys don't hear any sound from the game, and the reason for that is because uh, the sound is extremely high, and I can't control it, unfortunately, so uh, I'm gonna have to do, how do you open the fucking door? Uh, it doesn't open, oh, the door is locked, you have to find the fucking code, what the fuck are you talking, uh, seriously, code for every single fucking door in this room? Alright, let's try 3657 again, who knows, who go, who knows, 365 freaking 7, I did not, I don't want, okay, okay, there we go, and it did not, did it, did it freaking, did it, did it work, it did not work, fantastic. Alright, let's see what's in here, let's see what's in, the door is locked, you have to find the fucking code, are you kidding me, are you kidding, every single fucking door in this game has a freaking code that is written in a random paper, what the hell just happened? Oh crap, the battery of my freaking, oh god damn it, the, ba the battery of the... Oh my god. How exactly am I supposed to find the code in complete darkness right now? How, how exactly am I supposed am I supposed to just go around in the darkness until I randomly stumble upon something that tells me to read it and then I magically read it in the dark even though I'm not supposed to be able to read it? Now let's go back into the beginning and see what was written in there again. I guess there was something that I missed. I'm not exactly sure. Okay, how do I enter? How do I enter this place? Are there, the doors like try to find the code. Oh, I know the code of that one. I know the code of that one. All right, there we go. Three, six, five, seven. Okie dokie. Is it uh, opened? No. 
Alright, so I started the game over right now and I still cannot find something logical to be done here. I mean, I looked everywhere while I still got the battery and I still cannot find anything that could possibly have a code in it. I don't know, the only logical place to find the code is within this darkness. I, I can't find anywhere else, seriously, so uh, I don't know. I, let me just keep looking for a while. Alright, we have something in here, so let's take a look at it. Did I, did I take something just now? Did I take something? I didn't take something, did I? There was something in the floor that I just took. What was it? What was it exactly? Did I actually take something that could help me open the door or something? Like, let's just check. Alright, I started over again and I'm completely done. Like seriously, no, you have no idea how much done I am right now. Like this is my last try. So apparently there is something that needs to be done here, but I'm not exactly sure what it is. I mean, I interacted with it and it's not really doing anything. I don't get it. Oh my god, finally I found something. Fine, holy shit, holy shit. Alright, let's take a look what this has to say. Okay, I saw someone blah 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 leaving the room and the code was... Okay, you saw someone leaving the second room. The code was... Okay, and, and why the hell did you write this down and leave it in the floor just like that? I'm just wondering. I mean, you saw someone writing a code in the fucking door. Why the hell... How, that, that someone is obviously blind. I'm gonna let this pass, but... Why the hell did you write it down on a piece of paper and throw it in the floor? What the fuck? Alright, then. 2712. There we go. Okay. And... The second door is opened, hopefully. There we go. Exactly, exactly. What 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 are you talking about? Two seven one two two seven one two. I'm pretty sure that's the one. I'm pretty sure that's the one. Come on, open the damn door already. What the hell are you talking about? I'm pretty sure it's two seven one two. It's two seven. Okay, apparently it's in this room. Okay, hold on. Two seven one two. There we go. Let's see what we have here. Okay, open up. And it's what 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 the fuck are you talking about, guys? Am I missing something? Am I missing something right here? I mean, let's see. Two seven one two. 27, which is the number of the age of someone who is 27, and 12 is the number of teenager who is 12. I mean, I, I don't know. I don't know how to put it. I, I don't know how to put it. Like, seriously, I don't know. It's it locked. All right, let's try it again. 2, 7, 1, 2. There we go. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Uh, what, what are you talking about? Guys, what the fuck is going on? I saw someone leaving the second room, and the room is 2712. It is 2712. Two. There we go. Two seven one two. There we go. I I don't get it. I don't get it. Okay, the door is locked. Okay, let's try here again. Let's try here again. Two seven one two. I I I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay. Okay. Are we done here? Are we done? The door is locked. What the hell is going on? What the hell is going on? I'm pretty sure. Uh, let's let's read the read. Maybe I read it wrong the first twenty six times. The same exact wrong way. Two seven one two. What what else is there? What else is there? Should I try the 2712 in here? 2712? Is that it? Is that it? 2712? Oh, it is... Wait, what? Wasn't that the room I came from in the first place? I think it was, but... Oh yeah, that's the room I came from in the first place. Okay, so that's, that's the room then. Alright, let me guess. I'm gonna look for a random piece of paper that randomly has a code in it because some... Oh, I hope this piece of paper blah blah blah. Okay, never mind. 8331-3921. Hold it. This game is kind of stupid to be honest. Like, so what the hell are they even doing? Alright, so 3921. I think that was it. It was... It, yeah, there we go. Exactly. Now what the hell do we have here? Another piece of paper that has another random number in it. Okay. There we go. Another piece of paper. I, I, I can't even imagine. Today I saw the freaking whatever. 1509. There we go exactly okay let's go and write 1509 for no reason okay there we go so i guess this is a hospital for people that have a mental illness to write every single fucking password someone types in front of them for no reason down on a piece of paper and then they keep going on forward okay what now another fucking door that needs another fucking code you know what no i'm done i'm done so yeah guys that's that's the game that game that game is terrific by the way it's all about finding fucking codes and typing them like holy shit this game kind of reminds me of Slenderman, but instead of just collecting a bunch of stupid pointless papers that make a random uh, freaking monster comes after you, you actually collect a bunch of another stupid pointless papers that make no sense for their existence. Okay, take that thing. Did I take it actually? I mean, I'm supposed to take those things, right? I mean, uh, that's the second thing I actually uh, uh, attempt to take and I don't take it. What is even going on? Oh crap, I cannot back. I cannot back. Now, I, okay, now, okay, I have to click the inventory button and the back button is completely pointless. Whoever designed this is a genius. Like, the back button has absolutely zero reason to exist. What the hell are all these bottles in the ground? Like, seriously, everyone here is a freaking maniac that is a drug addict and keeps taking medicine for no reason. Alright, let's go upstairs. Let's go upstairs and see what we have here. What the hell's going on? What the hell's going on? Go upstairs, right now. 
Go upstairs. What the hell? Uh, yeah, have you not trained going upstairs ever in your life? Like ever? Oh, look at this amazing picture that is actually slightly rotated into the right. I think they are trying to, you know, portray the Biza Power. Uh, the Biza Power? What the hell am I talking about? I mean, uh, the inclined Biza Tower. I'm pretty sure that's the translation for it. I mean, I know how I know how it's called in Arabic, but uh, in English, I'm not exactly sure. But I think it's the inclined Biza Tower. No, but seriously, this game is supposed to be a horror game. But, uh, well, I'm pretty sure the horror is going to be later in the game. But you will need to, I don't know, be patient, I guess. You need to be patient and keep looking for freaking papers with codes all over the place until the horror comes in. I'm not that patient though, I'm not that patient, you know, I mean looking for papers that have codes in them is not exactly my cup of tea when it comes for video games, you know, I like action, I like killing people, that's that's my kind of video game. So yeah, I guess I'm gonna end it here, thanks for watching, I'll see you guys later, bye.